well, today we want to learn about how to create a new company using QuickBooks version 2010 but you have different varieties of QuickBooks you have version 10 you have 2015 among others but today we want to learn how to create this new company it is very simple we have two options first you need to go to you need to go to file at a file menu when you open QuickBooks there you can see now you can uh, go to new company uh, and a new then you click new company after new company you get the information about the uh, interview you have some you called interview progress this interview progress you have easy step interview you can either skip interview or you can start interview but in my case i want to skip interview so once you come to click in uh, skip interview here can see we have a skip interview and you have such interview skip interview is a better option in this case you see some of the enter the company information and have the company name and you have the recall name in this case the difference is almost the same but uh, we have uh, just a slight difference uh, for the company we have a search in computer query for example and we have the recall name which is such a mean for TV there is just a name but the other name is a brand name which maybe many people can recognize in this for example we have like Tasca mattresses and we have Tasca supermarket in this case many people they acknowledge as a Tasca, uh, Tasca supermarket uh, instead of Tasca mattresses or Nakumat holdings instead of Nakumat supermarket that's where people can at least understand more we have now the stitch address street address represent the physical address in this case you put the location of the business that is where you put for example current river road and you have often on the airport road in this case those are the road direction we have this city which is in nairobi county nairobi postcode you can put either the code of the area or the code of the country we have the country you have to choose the country you come from in this case you have the the option to choose there we have the France, Germany, Greece, and among others to choose. Just choose Kenya. After you choose Kenya, now from there you can put the phone number. For example, that one there is the phone number. Then you can put the business number with that which is you have registered with in your company of the register of the companies. In this case, you have to put the email address and the website as you can see the information. Once you feed that information correctly, now you can just ignore the facts and you go to the next click next you go to the next you can see now the interview progress is for is progressing as you have skipped the interview in this case how is your company organized we have the sole trader we have the partnership company and we have the non-profiting and other or none in this case sole trader is a business owned by one person or managed by one person we have the partnership whereby we have more than one, two or three partners. We have all, at least in this business, you have uh, it here contain two people. We have the company limited. In this case, it can be a form of business entity, uh, a limited company provided by the limited liability as its own. In this case, it can be a company managed by many people, a group of people, or a company registered by one person, but it is a very big company as compared to the the business in this case we have non-profiting which is non-NGOs for example which have been exempted from the uh, for paying taxes like for example NGOs in this case uh, you can choose one of them there after you choose one of them there then you can go to next you can just come here we have back and next you can just click next once you click next you can see the interview progress and now you can choose the financial year financial year is the day that you opened your company uh, whereby it will be ending at the same same month of the company let me for example put my company was registered on feb for example this feb then you can put now you can just click next once you click next you see a variety you have to select your industry this one is very crucial because each and every business have its own uh, category. In this case, you can see accounting or bookkeeping, they have advertising or public relations, 
church or religious organization construction among others in my case because as you can see the just name is such a infotech which means a reader in information technology which means my point of choosing is information technology but you can see we have a variety of them depending on what you want to do in your business we have the information technology as my selection in this case and you can see it have other accounts on this we have them consulting income we have sales of hardware we have among others each and every section you choose here you can see now the other side of the accounts changes depending on what you have chosen as you can see you choose a different one and the information changes you choose the example for the churches you can see now the information about the church the mission of offering prizes seminars among others the tides among others in this case side of this so it means you have to make sure you choose the right decision as for this one because if when you make a wrong choice you end up getting the wrong information that you didn't want that is why you have to scroll and see you have a variety of them as you can see there up to the bottom but in my case i have said i have to choose the what the information technology that is it how to choose the information technology you can see about sales hardware software and about the discount in my case i click now next once you click next now you can see the interview progress almost full and now you can told where should i save my company file in my case i can just click finish once you click finish it will show you where you can save your company you can choose for example this my pc and i go to you have different drives where you want not to save your company for example in my case i want to save maybe in drive c or i want to save my files another drive for example this such am admin so i want to save it and now i can save with the same same name such am computer courage and i click save then if you see how this is working you just wait until it become 100 percent now you can see it's progressing as working on this uh, you have to wait until it is 100 percent and 90 percent now and now after that it will be just open company that's how simple you can create a company using microsoft using quickbooks sorry this uh, bag of pardon using quickbooks in this case now you can see the name of our company which is now such a computer courage quickbooks pro and now you can see this information but before you go into here you can see there's some information missing in this home uh, chart layout in this case i need to add some information like product uh, with uh, like a uh, purchase uh, order you need to come to edit once you click edit you can see to preferences and from preferences you can have item in stock item is stock just go to company preferences and you put tick at the stock and purchase orders are active and you click ok you get a warning quickbooks must close all the opening windows which is this preference just click ok and you can see the changes they have closed all the windows and now you need to come to home and now you can see a difference they have added some information like purchase orders receiving items and you have others which will help you thank you and make sure that you follow our other tutorials we are such a kenya just look such a kenya in youtube